Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Mommy's List. I am somewhat decent today. I actually have a shirt on and some jeans and I just got him comfortable so he's rolling around in his pamper. And brother's watching TV currently in the living room. But I did a little haul. I'm not proud of it. I've been trying to save money, but just the way I am, when I find something I like or that I want to do, I'm on a roll with it. And it's like, gimme, 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 gimme. But at least I got everything on sale, so I did save a ton of money. Like, a ton of money. Just putting it out there. Um, my hair is really frizzy right now. It's like all over the place. But he had his doctor's appointment today, and so I went shopping. I told myself I wouldn't go to Target, and I ended up going to Target. But I didn't buy anything today at Target, but I did buy some stuff at Target the other day. So, um, with the hurricane... Um, we packed up everything and, um, we went to my dad's house, my mom and dad's house, and we stayed there for about a week. Um, my husband had to leave with his command. Of course, my husband's military, so he had to leave and go with, um, his group for the, um, hurricane and all that. So he's still not home, but we have to wait. I don't know when he'll be home. So, okay. So. While I was there, I just started binge watching YouTube and it all of a sudden popped up on my feed to like recommend it, things to watch. And it was a plan with me and a budget with me. And then I was all for budgeting. I was like, yes, this is what I need in my life. And I was talking about budgeting before my husband had left. Um, so that's why I was looking at that. And then it popped up because I was looking at budget with me it popped up plan with me and I had no idea that there was like extreme planning to where like you have like these really fancy planner books and you have these sticker sets and it's basically like scrapbooking and planning all rolled into one and I am all about that life I love scrapbooking like all my friends know me I love scrapbooking I have so many boxes upon boxes in my craft room but I have no ways to get to it because my craft room is a hot mess. I have a ton of yard sale items like baby items and like clothes that don't fit us. And it's just all thrown into that room. So um, I know I keep switching back and forth. My arms are insanely sore right now. I've been carrying him around all day in his car seat. <laughs> You're a mess. You are a mess in there. I see you. You're a mess. What are you doing? So, um, I'm going to flip the screen and I'm going to show you properly what I got because what I recorded, I like did like really quick. Like, oh, look, I bought this today. And then I did a little snip of, oh, I bought this today. So, let me just show you what I've got. Some things. I'm pretty sure everything here is new. So... Let me show you what I got, and then, yeah, I'll, that's about it. Okay, so this is my planner from last year. Um, this only went to um, July, July 2018, yeah. And as you can tell, I don't know what to do with all that, with all that extra paper. I usually just go to the month and then schedule all of my um my appointments and doctor visit when my husband has to leave with his command all that kind of stuff that's what i usually do with my planners i bought this one at walmart it was it's like a little binder and then it has this planner belongs to and then of course it has like the month tab you know and then it has, like, see, I just write uh, church picnic and stuff. Like, I just write what's happening for the month. And then that's that's pretty much all I do. All the papers that were in between it, like all the papers that look like this Monday through Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, whatever. Um, all those pages I just took out because I didn't know what to do with them so it's basically like a waste of money because this was basically all those 
Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and they look like this. On Tuesday, and then it was like Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, whatever, you know. And they look like that. So, with the new planner that I bought, I actually bought the um, memory keeping one. I bought these at Michael's. I got these on sale. These were like a dollar for these little stickers. A dollar, a dollar, a dollar for these little stickers here. They're little flags just to write notes and stuff. And those will fit fine in this. Um, I just bought this one today. This is the Happy Memory Keeping Sticker Book. And this is, um, this was like $8 at Michael's. And then it has all these beautiful big stickers because the spots in this book are almost double the size of the regular just planners. Um, and then I did buy the Mom Mini mom book which i figured i could use all of these little stickers in here and it would be perfectly fine um so these i bought at michael's and then this i bought there at michael's and it looks like this and then each month you know it has this i added a few things to it i've already decorated um the first week i'm gonna have this which i kind of somewhat decorated and then i noticed like the stickers were like really small um, but I'm go to like to December. So, um, I already put the dates on it and then I have a few stickers and the weeks are like this. So it's Monday through Sunday and then it's like morning, afternoon and at night, which I really like. So this is the memory one where you can, um, they sell a thing where you could buy um, the camera and all that and then you take pictures and it's self-adhesive like it has self-adhesive in the back and they fit perfectly into these little squares and then you can write whatever you want on like these or like put stickers down or whatever you want but I'm just going to use it like a regular planner and just plan everything out and then just go as the day goes by and write down little things that happened and use stickers to cover up most of the stuff because my life ain't that fun um but they do have really beautiful beautiful things um the little dividers are like gorgeous they are so pretty um and then it came with like little things like some merry christmas and then like you put pictures and stuff of christmas and um then it has like the end of the month. It has things that you loved about what happened in the month and like your favorite memories of the month. So I did like that. Um, and then it has like the little quote stuff, but usually people cover that up. I don't know why, but it's already there. And usually people just get the stickers for it and cover it up. But I got that at Michael's. Let's go to Dollar Tree. I found, I just found these today at Dollar Tree and these are little stickers. I found them super cute, but these stickers here, let me see if I can pull it up. I figured those would probably fit in the boxes fairly well. Look, it's got like, look how cute these are. These are so stinking cute for a dollar. These are adorable. And it comes with uh, 265 stickers. I guess I wanted between those. Look how cute little flags and all that for um, jotting down all your notes and putting stuff down. Payday work. Look, these are just so stinking cute for a dollar. A dollar for all these stickers. Look how cute they are. Look at them, see? So I bought two of those. They did have um, different styles, but I like that one the best. So I just bought two of those. And then I got this little sticker book that has like Valentine's stuff in it. It was so cute for Valentine's Day. So I figured I'd just buy it and keep it for Valentine's Day. Then I got some um, glue tape, little rollers, uh, correction tape, cover up. And I also bought these correction, correction pens as well from the dollar store. Um, this book is actually on sale for $10 for the mom book. The memory book was on sale for 8 And then the actual memory keeping planner, this big boy, was $14.50, I think, on sale, 60% off. So, that's why I bought it. 
Um, then Target, I got some Scotch uh, washi tape. Look how cute these are, little pineapples and little flamingos. And then like this like to-do appointment, you know, kind of stick it. Dollar thirty eight, yes. And then um the fitness tracker. This has twelve months in it, and again, it's just like the memory one where they're not dated specifically. So um I can do it with a whatever month I want to start on. But it has breakfast, snack, lunch, snack, dinner, and then it has what does that say? Exercise. <laughs> That'll stay blank. Um, but it has water like to keep you hydrated. And I figured this would be good for me to try to keep track of my food and my sugars for my diabetes. So I picked this up. It was only six bucks. So I picked that up. And then this was on sale. It's a sticker book from um, them as well. And this has like the holidays in it. But these don't fit this one, I believe. And they don't fit, really fit this one because this one's too big. So these are like the classic everyday planner. But um, yeah. Then Walmart, I got some washi tape and some sticker packs. And I got the sticker book here. The sticker packs look like this. They, they just came like this double sticker pack. Um, and then I also got some um, post-it notes and then the washi tape that I've been using besides using those. Um, and this sticker book has 30 sheets of stickers. It doesn't say how many stickers are actually in it. But I figured I could use these two. These would probably fit good in the smaller, this book. But yeah, that's pretty much my haul. That's what I bought. That's what I got. So I, I'm going to start this next month. And I'm kind of anxious because I want to start it now. But I'm like... Mm -hmm. I'm trying to wait and hold so, it. So that's everything for my little haul. I mean, not too bad. Like, I could have done a lot more damage. Like, but um, there's a lot of people that are on Etsy that sell pages and monthly spreads and stuff for these planners and everything. But I don't feel like spending. Will you stop screaming? <laughs> I don't feel like spending $5 per sheet page of sticker that they create but they are gorgeous and you can't just be like oh no because I had to stop myself because I would have definitely spent way over my budgeted amount that I allowed myself to spend on random items um, so yeah I definitely would have gotten in trouble <laughs> for buying a bunch of stickers but at least these, um, the most I've spent was maybe $20 for all of my stickers. Like, no, I lied because these two alone are 18 So maybe $30 on stickers. Yeah. Because this was like $3. This big book was $3 at Walmart on sale. And the little ones were a dollar. So yeah, I, it's probably like 30 bucks on stickers. It's a lot, but told you i can't help myself it just spirals so i'm just bad but at least it's going to be put to use and i'm actually going to use it because i really like the setup and the way that it works in jotting down everything that you do during the day so then it's more of like a memory as well of okay i can go back and see oh i ate pizza this day you know stuff like that all right well i'm gonna let you go because he's getting stuck in the corner and he's just rolling all over the place what are you doing What are you doing? He put himself in the corner. I don't. He was on the pillow. He was on that pillow. Right there. And rolled himself over here into the corner. So let me help him. And I will see you guys in another video. Alright, bye. Love you.